Alright hockey loving fans, the NHL season is just upon us and 2K Games has released finally a hockey game for the iPhone, NHL 2K11 and I'll be reviewing version 1.0.2. Now the first question you may ask, how does a sports game like hockey play out on the iPhone where it has no physical buttons to use? To answer that, it actually works pretty well. The controls are simplified down to three buttons on the bottom right corner of the screen that are context sensitive depending on the situation. With the puck in possession you have the option to pass, shoot, and speed burst. When you don't have it in possession you can body check, speed burst, and switch between players. Now the body check button is context sensitive depending on where you hit the player as you're coming across them. So it may end up being a poke check, uh, a hook, a body check, whatever. It's context sensitive. Now you move your player across the screen with a digital D-pad in the bottom left corner of the screen and it actually is pretty smooth and I hadn't had much issue with moving the player around. I did however find that during frantic situations um, it is a little bit cumbersome to be switching players and body checking at the time. Sometimes I find myself not being able to switch to the player that I want to use but after a few quick games I was able to learn the controls and stick to them pretty well. I can't imagine however playing a match at full game speed. That would be just too chaotic. Now as you can see the graphics leave a little bit to desire. The textures and character models are a little bland and very low res. The iPhone is capable of better graphics than this, especially the iPhone 4 and speaking of that it doesn't even support retina display at this moment. What's even more of an eyesore is the crowds in the stands which are basically just low res very low res static 2D sprites. Moving on from graphics to sound and music, I'll start off first by saying that all the sound effects in the game are exactly what you come to expect in a hockey game. They're, they're fine, they're normal, and everything's great. However, the music in this game is atrocious. It is terrible. It is a complete, complete dismute it. Music in this game is so annoying, and it's just like this recycled MIDI track, and I absolutely have to like mute the mute it. I can't stand it that much. But what I do love is the almost endless amount of statistics and stats in this game. Stats for everything. 2K Sports has done a great job of making their iPhone title feel like their home console franchise. In fact, there's quite a few game modes to choose from. You can jump right into a game with quick play mode, you got free skate, shootout mode, and of course, a fully in-depth season mode. With the season mode, you'll be doing everything from negotiating trades, worrying about the salary cap, setting up lines, adjusting your coaching strategies, everything you would come to expect with a fully fledged season mode. And of course, slide a range of options to set up your season, like how much the salary cap should be, how many games you should play in the season, the length of the playoff series everything. The one thing this game desperately needs is a roster update. 2K Sports really needs to get on that. None of the off-season trades are in this game. For example, my favorite team, the Oilers, Taylor Hall and Eberle aren't even in the lineup. Let's hope 2K Sports updates the roster just in time for the NHL season to start. And until 2K11 also supports multitasking, which is great so you can jump in and out between games. No multiplayer mode, which is a huge disappointment and major oversight. It would be nice to have at least a local multiplayer option. Playing against the AI is okay, but nothing beats the challenge of playing against a human opponent. It would be even more sweet if the game had some sort of online multiplayer over 3G. Maybe in an update. So for you hockey lovers out there who have an iPhone or are itching to play some hockey on the go, then look no further to 2K11. And the controls are great, the graphics are subpar, it has a fully fledged season mode, I mean, what can you ask more for a portable iPhone hockey game? Well, I guess a multiplayer mode would be nice, actually. But considering it's the only fully-fledged hockey game on the iPhone at the moment, I would definitely say this is a pick-up-and-play game for any of you hockey lovers out there. And for my final review for 2K11, I'm giving it a B. And that is it for my review of 2K11. For more great iPhone game reviews, check out our website, usercreatorcontent.ca, and for everything gaming.